What is going on guys, my name is Suti and EA have released this list on every chemistry style in the game But it's not that easy, the hunter chemistry style for example sucks on quick players I'm gonna explain everything to you in the next 3 minutes Also substitutes and changing formation in game, I know everything about it guys, let's go For an amazing FIFA 17 squad, link is in the description for cheap and safe coins And do you wanna play against me, get a gameplay analysis for personal FIFA lessons, link is also in the description so how does chemistry for substitutes count? Well you can see the statement from EA here, how chemistry is calculated, but the notable thing about this statement is actually the second part. A uh, substitute will always have chemistry 5. If you put Bale as a striker in a Bundesliga squad, if you put him as a right winger in actually a La Liga squad, doesn't matter, he will always have chemistry 5. You can even use him as a goalkeeper, doesn't matter, his chemistry will be 5. How does team management like changing positions affect chemistry? As you can see it doesn't affect chemistry in any way and this opens up a lot of opportunities guys. For example let's look at this squad. I want Ronaldo as a striker, I want Bale on midfield. What would be the problem of that? That Ronaldo and Bale will be on 7 chemistry. I do not like that, I want my striker on full 10 chemistry. So how can we solve this now we know this information? We could start actually with this team. Everyone will be on the full 10 chemistry and then in game make sure you do it in game switch back to this formation and every single player will have 10 chemistry because as you can see from the EA statement chemistry styles do not change when you do team management in game okay so now let's have a look at the chemistry styles this is the most tricky part guys if you have full chemistry so 100 team chemistry 10 player chemistry then this uh, accounts guys and an interesting thing is uh, the maximum of 99 that's the interesting thing basically if your total chemistry is above 50 you will gain you will gain attributes but there's a maximum of 99 and this is what a lot of you weren't taking into account before this information let's look at all the chemistry styles which are important for attacking you can see sniper it gives me 15 plus finishing 15 dribbling and hunter of course used a lot it will give me 15 plus in acceleration 10 plus in sprint speed if i'm gonna use this on ronaldo he will be super quick i'm gonna use hunter on ronaldo is what a lot of you are doing if you look at ronaldo's base stats that are the one in gray uh, so on basic chemistry he will have those attributes which you can see on screen now Let's check it out now for all chemistry styles guys and this is where it becomes interesting look at all the values in red those are basically the values where you are wasting yes wasting your chemistry on look at the 106 acceleration at hunter you get plus 15 in acceleration for hunter but here in reality you only get plus 8 look at the 108 value for finishing at uh, sniper you will think you will get plus 15 for finishing but you you really don't and if we look at the shooting if we compare hawk versus hunter let's look at the finishing etc it's the very same as hunter if you use hawk he will be just as good as shooting as he would have been on hunter well hunter gives you plus three for shooting in the uh, image and hawk only plus two and also on pace he's pretty much the same uh, pace on hawk as on hunter so basically hunter is a very bad choice for the chemistry style on ronaldo because the maximum value for any attribute is 99 so now we already know how to use Ronaldo as a 10 chemistry striker but the question we may have to ask ourselves is our informs or especially team of the season cards are they still worth it? We've heard it a lot before they don't feel better in game and this is the reason guys the maximum value is 99 anyway are those team of the season still worth it? He won't be much better than the real Ronaldo the regular Ronaldo in game because the maximum value is 99 anyway but on the team of the season card if you pick the right chemistry style which might improve his dribbling or maybe his strength only he would still be a little better but not that much guys for lower rated players there will be less problems but let's have a look at a defender example now these are the chemistry styles which you would probably consider for defending I've uh, picked out the main attributes I've neglected shooting etc if you apply the chemistry styles on Alba and Alaba from Bayern this will be their effect and if we look at shadow on Alba 
it doesn't work that well. It, it has the same speed on Ensure. So that's basically the uh, mistake a lot of you were making before this information. I pick Alba, he's super quick. Let's put him on Shadow, he will be even quicker. But it doesn't work like that. Ensure is a much better chemistry style for Alba. Uh, than uh, Shadow and maybe for Alaba you do want to pick Shadow as the best chemistry style it all depends on the player guys and the main important thing is the maximum value is 99 anyway so yeah how to use wingers as strikers correctly our team of the season still worth it how to pick the best chemistry style for each player which will be very important it can differ a lot it took me a lot of time to find out all this information and present it to you like this guys. Make sure to drop a like if you enjoyed, subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. Usually I'm all about gameplay tutorials. My name is Suti, see you next time.